Here you can see I have this pipe looking model and I want to UV unwrap it. How will I do this? It's very simple. First I will give it texture. So just select that and then texture and here I have created that UV grid texture. And you can see the texture at here and you can see that weird stretching. Now just we need to add seams on it to UV unwrap it. So I will go to the edit mode. Just turn off that sub D modifier a little bit. You can see this edge. Select that edge loop and then control E add a seam on it. Okay. Now select everything and then UV you unwrap. I will get something like this and let's see the texture. And now I got this kind of texture which looks really well but we can improve it. So now just I will take it and then shift D to duplicate it and keep it at here. Okay. Now we will add more seams on it to properly UV unwrap this texture. What will I do? I will select this corner edge loops as like this, this corner rings and then control E mark seam. Then here also you can select these rings and then control E mark seam. And just take the symmetry so we will get those seams to this side also. Mesh and then symmetrize and you can see I have got those same seams to this side. Now I will select everything and then UV, you unwrap. And you can see the texture which I have got at here. This looks way better than this one. You can compare these two models. You can compare their texture. You can compare their UV unwrapping. You can see the UV island at here. And you can see the UV islands at here. These all are separate UV islands, you can see. So this is the simple tip for the UV unwrapping. If you want to UV unwrap any kind of pipe looking model, then just break its UV islands. So it will be more easier for you to pack these UV islands. You can see easily you can adjust the scale, you can pack them, you can do anything. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching. If you like this tutorial, then hit that like button and subscribe to YouTube channel. Bye bye. See you next video. Take care.